after the experience I've had with working with uh, both children and adults with computers and at least dabbling in the areas of learning and education, I think that the, the, one of the best ways of thinking of a computer is very similar to thinking of what a piano means in teaching music. And the piano ha can amplify musical impulse. We can only sing uh, with, with one voice. If we want to play a, a four-part fugue, we have to use some, something mechanical like a piano to do it. And it can be done very beautifully. But for most people, the piano has been the biggest thing to turn millions of people away from music for the rest of their lives. And I think the, the way to sum it up is just to say that all musicians know that the music isn't in the piano. If it were, we'd have to let it vote. And because of that, that says in any situation where education and learning is involved that you first have to develop a curriculum based on ideas, not on media. Media can be amplifiers of those ideas, but you have to have the ideas first. And I think the reason computers have failed is that almost everybody, no matter which way they try and use computers, have wanted the computer to be some sort of magic ointment over the superating wound of, of bad concepts. And I think as soon as people get, what we saw is an amazing learning experience in the Tim Galway tennis experience. And that is something that can extend and be amplified by uh, machines and especially computers. But first you have to have the ideas.